guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, today of all days, I have a video for you. And I'm going to talk you through my Michael Kors watch. Now, this is, let me get it up, a beautiful, beautiful design watch. This is the Michael Kors runway watch. I am going to take it off so I can fully show you guys everything. But I'm just going to wipe the back of it because you get sweaty. So, this is the runway watch. I'll start off by showing you around my watch. So we have Michael Kors on the back of the strap. I love little details like that with Michael Kors. It is on the back. This reads and monitors your heart rate. It is also on the little buckle. There is Michael Kors just at the top. I don't know if you will focus or you can see it, but it is just here. I got this for Christmas. I didn't put this in my Christmas list because I wanted to do a whole separate video on it. And I am obsessed. I don't take it off. <laughs> I take it off a bed because you have to to charge it and the charger just literally plops straight onto the back. However, I did learn very fast that something in my bedroom had broke. It was the teeniest, tiniest piece of metal. I don't know what it was. So when it had hooked because obviously the back is magnetic, it hooked to it. The watch had gone onto it and because of this little teeny tiny, tiny piece of metal, it no longer charged. I was like, what the hell? I thought it broke. So to get your watch working on an iPhone, <laughs> You have to download the app for it. And what was the app called? The Wear OS app. Now, this monitors your heart rate, your move minutes. You get heart points per day. It tells you how many calories you've burnt, how many steps you've burnt. It brings up messages, emails, any notifications that you would like. And all you do is you go onto the app and you can change the notifications that you receive and which ones you do not. So, for an instance, Every so often I get um, a notification from ITV. I don't want that showing up on my watch. So it goes. But yeah, this will show a message. I can read the message. I can't read a picture message. I can read a message whether it is on WhatsApp whether it, or if it is just a normal message. I love it. You cannot reply back from it though. That is a downfall. But I see it as a good thing. I don't want to be glued to this 24-7. It is a watch at the end of the day. And I know we're getting all technical and you should be able to reply back on a watch. I don't like the idea of replying back on a watch because I think I'm on my phone constantly, but I can put my phone away. So at work, I can leave it in my pocket and if I get a message, I can quickly flick, read the message and go, oh yeah, that's great. But I can't reply. So... It actually st probably stops me getting into a lot of trouble, to be fair. It's the same as taking phone calls. I can answer the phone call on this, but I can't physically do it through the watch. I can't talk through the watch. I can answer it if it's, like, important and it's in the bottom of my bag. I can answer it quick and then start screaming, I can't find my phone, I'll be with you in a second, it's in my bag somewhere. I can find it like that, and that is great. Or it's, like, if my daughter's school phones me. It alerts me to tell me I'm getting a phone call from the school, which is absolutely fantastic because when I work all the hours I work, it's bloody brilliant, let me tell you. So I can do all things like that. You can leave notes on this. You can do anything that you want, really. It's locked. It always locks when it's not attached to your wrist. So first thing in the morning, I will have to put it on my wrist and I have to unlock it. You go on, you've got everything on there that you need to. So for instance, your agenda is on there. I have started now using my diary a lot more on my phone because my agenda tells me everything I need to know for the next three days. So what's happening tomorrow? What is happening on Wednesday? What is happening when the next three days are? There is a torch built into the phone, which can be very handy. You can have an alarm. Oh, it's locked itself again. Don't look that bright. It is in the dark, let me assure you. I love it. And then, of course, there is, I wanted to keep this on my wrist, to, just to stop it from locking. Um, so far today, I have only done 63 steps, but somehow burned 859 calories, which I do not believe for one second that that is right. Bear you. No idea how I've done that. That's definitely wrong. But... That was a real good selling point for the watch, wasn't it? Hey, it's how many calories you burn. Oh, that must be wrong. I've definitely not done that. Okay. 
it has the rings like on the apple watch you, unfortunately you can't personalize your rings on here though you can personalize like how many heart points you want and how many move minutes you want per day but you cannot personalize the rings and put different things on it other than that i love it it is a watch look i've got marks on my wrist from wearing it that much <laughs> but anyway i love it so much i do want another strap for it i want like maybe the rose gold strap um just because uh, the actual stainless steel one <laughs> make it more dressy up because i do tend to wear this a lot and it's always on my wrist you can have the um display i found this out very early on that moves so i had the falling stars so when the screen is upright the stars would fall to the bottom if i was to tilt my watch the stars would then just follow wherever my watch face went it was beautiful the battery lasted four hours um, i can get through my whole working day on my watch easy but if i have an animated screen like if it sparkles or anything like that it's dead within four hours now you do have pay on this apple pay i have linked that up worst mistake of my life because if you have apple pay on your phone you might not start saying what's your phone on you when i am skint i leave my phone uh, away so i can't get to it it's in my locker at work so i can't spend money on it or when for instance i really really skin i disable it i can disable it on my phone and i actually stopped having it on my phone for a while and only had used my bank card and then if i didn't have any money i'd leave my bank card at home fantastic it was great and then i set it up on this try easy it is to go boom Deed. there's your payment process thank you I'm like, oh no i've always got my watch i've always got my watch on me so now i spend money where i do not need to be spending money let me tell you oh i'll just buy those sweets because they're only a pound it's not good for my waistline either let me tell you but yes that is my quick little review on my michael kors runway smartwatch i love it i enjoy it however if you do want it for more tech purposes like messaging back sending emails back and things like that it's probably not the watch for you but i am obsessed and i love it and i'm so happy that i got it i'd like to thank you so much for watching if you've made it this far and you haven't already please click that subscribe button on all the pages there click over in this corner check out one of my latest videos and click down here to see a video that youtube has selected for you i'd like to thank you so much for watching take care i'll see you in a few days with another video and bye bye